Welcome back to Endless Mode. I am apparently still special guest Chief Stymac. Damn right. I'm Boku Bell. What is this, five, six episodes <laughs> in? Uh, I'm Captain Emoji. And I'm Mysterious Gamer X. And I think in order to lose special guest, you have to play a second game with us. Mm -hmm. I mean, but I really like Dark Souls. <laughs> You know, Dark Souls 2 will count. <laughs> oh, man. our way through this now, one. Don't Dark make Souls any, 2. Oh, don't make our any promises. I like that. Uh, we, we've, got a, we've got a good balance going on with three people. I don't want to I don't want to start <laughs> I don't want to start messing with that core chemistry here. Uh, don't look at any of our uh, fighting game episodes. You guys made fighting game episodes without me. Well, we can make them with you. If now, you want. Please God, no. <laughs> there it is. <laughs> I'll be in my trailer. <laughs> so we're obviously back here playing Dark Souls. And uh, we're going to go fight a Taurus demon, I guess? Yeah, we, we saw the boss. That's um, a sign. We the got Taurus. as far as seeing the next boss. We realized we had way too many souls. We ate a bunch more souls. We went back and spent those souls. And now we're just going to scooch our way up to the boss again. I'm going to jump into this room and get murdered. Literally jumped. <laughs> Didn't get murdered. Kind now, why do we always fight There's everything? Still time. Do we have to? Well, no, but they got really long leashes. They can follow you quite a long ways. Okay, I mean, we've experienced that for sure already. I was gonna say it's like the skeletons, where they followed us across the now, continent. Now, call them by their Christian names. They're skelly jellies. <laughs> now, skelly jellies are jellies with bones in them. God, that's very good, though. Okay, redacted. <laughs> Are there, I mean, I'm they might also be a Dragon Quest monster, but I'm not 100% certain on that. I would love to meet them. I would love to hold them gently, because you have to, because they're jelly. <laughs> uh, I will admit, I recently got into the, the Dragon Quest world, sort of, through Dragon Quest Builders, and I saw that there are angel slimes, little pink slimes with little wings and little halos. It's just so their, their slimes are very adorably designed. And there's the really cute little ones with little bat wings. I mean, ah, heck. It's so good. It's it, it has it has great design. Dragon Quest jellies are my favorite Pokemon. <laughs> <laughs> so what's our plan for this Taurus demon? Are we going to force him off that bridge? Can I mean, that? that is how I beat the Taurus demon the very first time I played this. And it felt so anticlimactic that I immediately restarted the game and played all the way back up to that point. Really? Because wow. once you defeat the boss, you can't fight the boss again. Really? What? So you restarted the game because it didn't feel, it felt too much like Dark Souls? Anticlimactic <laughs> and sudden? <laughs> that is really unfair to this entire <coughs> franchise. That's and sick. I think that you'll agree with that when we fight some more uh, top tier bosses. God, that was such a good burn in a world that's already scorched. I don't... I just... <laughs> I might need an Estes after that burn. Oh, man. Very good. Very good joke. Better than my joke. All right. So, so far we're only down one Estes Flask, because... Yeah, I don't remember right. why. Are you going to take him with you? <laughs> so, guys, we could Taurus Demon, or... And I'm just spitballing no, here. No, We can fight that guy no. downstairs again. You know, we it's got a like, better weapon load up and we know what we're doing. Fighting that guy again is like going back to an ex that you know you can't make it work. Why <laughs> spend the energy? You have so much, you have such limited time on this earth. Why spend the energy on a lost cause? On a dead end? I don't know if Dark Souls is going to be the right <laughs> franchise <laughs> for us, if that's our... Mm -hmm. our Sentiment. Hey, a long hey, sword. Just, just from a what, proper slashy sword. Just from what little I know of the rich lore. Mm -hmm. Everything's on fire. That's the first part of the rich lore. Uh, snap into a slim gym. It's your body now. So now we have a slashy sword and a stabby sword. This is uh, as much fun as I think this would be. I also think it's profoundly stupid. So yeah, probably. Let's. Uh, Let's see. Hey! See, that sword is just all the way better. Yeah. Except it does strength instead of dex, but it also gets both strength and dex at C. Yeah. Man, longsword is just best sword. It is the Cadillac of swords. It's true. <laughs> 
So a million you years ago, definitely go stab that armored guy. A million, <laughs> a million years. All ago, I was waiting for was permission. By the way. <laughs> God damn it! Just go kill it. Although maybe equip your shield in your other hand. Hard pass. Thanks though. Okay. <laughs> That's a negatory there, Kimasabi. Hard pass, because, I mean, the shields are really for for starters. <laughs> and, oops, I died. You know it's his controller. You got a guy you behind you. got somebody you. behind you. Oh, oh this hell. has all gone wrong. Oh, everything. No. Oh, no. <laughs> everything has just... We have fallen into just a fuck-up <laughs> cascade. <laughs> that guy wasn't there before. Where'd that guy come Hard from? Hard pass, Kimasabi. <laughs> I don't need things like... Shields. We're gonna, we're gonna fight him on a roof. I was gonna say, are we gonna this find sounds out? like a good idea. Use actually. your fire. You Stab have fire. Death, yeah. Oh heck, that flurry. You have... Okay, I think the big guy gave up on you. No, he's down there. I guarantee it. I saw him walking away. I did not. I mean, I saw I saw I him walking you. away, but I don't know if he just moved out of frame or if he went back. Home. Yeah, there he is. Oh, plunging attack? Yeah, that's my plan. If I can get a good line of sight on him. Mm -hmm. Where did you go, buddy? Behind you. <laughs> so that guy cannot climb ladders. He is too big. He's too big of a boy. Uh, I mean, I think that makes him a man though. by default. Oh, that looks good. Oh, boy. Nice shield, my dude. It would be a shame if anything was to happen to it. Use your fire. <laughs> you have fire. To be fair, I, I I don't know if the time it would take to equip it would be worth it, given his pursuer. Oh man, he will follow you to the ends of the earth, huh? Oh, oh no. Ha <laughs> ha! Nice! Oh. Right through the delicate parts. So I'm not great at Dark Souls, mm -hmm. uh, as... Mm -hmm. uh, okay. I don't need a, sh a shield is really something for, I would say, uh -oh. starter... I'm much more of a survivalist. <laughs> I would never uh, describe myself that way, but no. Oh. Yep. No. Oh. Oh no! Don't, because if you die, it's my my turn. I just. You don't have to fight this guy. You can go fight the next boss. Let's see how far he'll follow. Oh shit! There's guys down here. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I think we found the end of his tether, though. Fire him! Light his ass up! Oh, oh. no, we didn't! We did not! I was wrong! I was wrong, and I'm sorry for everything I've ever done! Fire! Oh, God! <laughs> it's just... Oh, no! Take him to the kiss of booze. Let him meet the sweet girls. <laughs> On the bright side, I think that that is actually it. I think that's as far as he'll come. <laughs> Every fucking time you say that. Yeah, but this Jason time... Voorhees. I'm yeah. like 97% mm -hmm. that I'm right. Mm -hmm. You'll notice I won't go higher than 97. <laughs> okay, so... I mean, he is at like half health. Does, does he so reach does him he when he walks walk away? Back, or... Yeah, he's there right he there. Oh, there he is. Sauntering back. Fear, fear balling. Well, if we can sneak up on him, we can do another one of those glorious stab oh. but Fear ball the man. Ah! The big man is is fire of one thing, and that's fear balls. Uh, oh, well. well. But on the plus side, our yeah. souls, all 1900 of them, are right there. So. I was gonna say, it is just a. It would be a shame if I right died turn. immediately. So we're passing it off, Boku Bell. Boku Bell and get the helm. I will not intentionally die. I can promise that. Well, I would, I would hope not. I would really rather you didn't sabotage the entire Let's Play. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I mean, it's a trademark. But <laughs> okay, Slash Aronis. Oh God, I forgot about these guys. Max 
nice. So. Nope, oh. nope. Careful. <laughs> well, remember what we learned about falling damage from last time. There you go. Hey! Well done. Hey. We got our souls and our humanity we go, back. Go, we're going the wrong direction now. Are we? Yeah. I mean, you can always double back. This is a very double back heavy game. I mean, I, I have no internal sense of direction. Plus, we so can I'm spend need... those souls so we don't have to worry about losing them. Uh, That's true. We go to the bonfire. Since, since we're talking about Where's the bonfire? Up the stairs. Up these stairs? Yeah. yeah. And then hang left. 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 Over the bridge without guardrails. There Arrested we go. Arrested bonfire. And level then... up. Oh, level up? Okay. Come on. Unfortunately, we just can't break. Um. Is that all I can do? That's all yeah. we can do. We only okay. have enough for one level. Although, if you stab a guy, you'll have enough for the next level. Okay. Really? Well, Although we didn't, funny. we didn't level up. We didn't. We didn't. We pretended to. I hate these goddamn menus, guys. So you got to scroll down. Initialize. To... Okay. Yep. No. Uh, Remembering what, what uh, initialize means. You just gotta scroll down to accept. Or, I guess, you, you can back out, too. There we I, go. I'm, I hate this menu. <laughs> Jesus Christ. They're back oh, those now guys you are rested. back, too. Sweet. Every time you rest. On well, plus side, it means we can get that, like, one match of souls we need. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so my another one of the great things about this game is you may have noticed uh, during the opening that they just licensed Havoc for a physics engine, and they just they were so excited to use it. They they really did not. Uh, okay, now we now we're going the wrong direction. <laughs> put a lot of time and effort and care into what the body rag dolls do, like. I have noticed that they sometimes string along after us. So uh huh. Dangle a bit. Just, just a tab. You know There's three guys in that room. Two guys in that room. There you go. No guys in that room. Nice job. Hatred fuels me. <laughs> guys in that building. You don't and have he to will come that after building, you. Though, do you? He'll come after you. Guys in the foyer. This has been your daily guys update. <laughs> it's a fan cast for the... For the Dark Souls community. I was actually going to say, uh, for... Lord... Lord... What is it, Lord... Lord... Lord Nom? Come on, Strangle uh, Dick. The, the... The Gashapon guys cast. toys from Steven oh, Universe. There we go. Yeah. You might want to click X. How do I do that? Oop. With the X button. Hip. Oop. <laughs> there we go. Come here, you son of a bitch. I'm so tired. See? Now what you're punching I... him! What did I unequip? No, you know what? Life is hard and it never stops and I'm very tired. And it's past well, my bedtime. Well, it did. It stopped. <laughs> Just in time for us to have enough souls to level up a gun. There you All go. Right. Mysterious. Oh, okay. <laughs> That's where our Boku souls live. Bell dies the brave death. <laughs> that was pretty good, actually. I was gonna say you were punching it up there. At the yeah, end. it's it's the equipment that got me. I probably should have just stuck with the sword and not bothered healing till afterwards when I when I could figure it out. Yeah, I think you uh, I have you got that D pad and it messed you up. Yeah, I have been told that healing in combat is a, a risky maneuver. Very much that has, so. That has killed many a dark soul. <laughs> you know, it's funny you say that, uh, because, uh, what is the Dark Soul ah. is a uh, lore question that people who don't understand how stories work often ask. <laughs> really? Yeah. I was, I was just being facetious. Were they raised but, uh, on movies from the 80s where the, t 80s where the title was always said sometime in the movie? Maybe, uh, but. Seriously, I was, I was just being facetious. Hollow but... Warrior. Yeah, we got a new uh, new coat if we want. Hell yeah! I mean, it'd be hard to beat the 
tattered cloth robe poncho. Well, but. it's got more spilled, physical defense and less magic defense. We've spilled a lot of heavier. BLK water on the tattered robe, and I think it's time. Yes! Oh, good. <laughs> Looks today. We lost all of our pouches. I like our... Uh, you are still in the menu. Oh, no. I like our leathery butt cheek situation that we've got kind of poking out, like a little peekaboo. <laughs> <laughs> so... We've lost all of our pouches. Ground Blackfield is silently weeping somewhere. <laughs> doesn't we're, know why. We're kind of why. like the, uh, the picked bog Why do I feel really emotions things? other than anger? I mean, if you look at even just our, uh, our bill, keeping in mind that Lucky is a woman. Uh-huh. Like, Rob Blackfield was not going to be happy about this anyway. <laughs> no, um... I don't know. I think we almost have the proper waist ratio. Uh, <laughs> That's being because a we're in... corpse. <laughs> our and our legs are about as thick as an arm. I will say. Uh, I'm curious what the foot situation is, but we have one boot. <laughs> you only need one boot. One book boot to keep one foot nice and soft, so that she can properly promote uh, toe bangers, Ow. and then. One foot to stay hard and leathery, so she's always grounded in this world. <laughs> <laughs> so this world are the, of the undead. So now we've learned a little bit more about the rich <laughs> mythology that is uh, our player character, Lucky. Yeah. Well, you know, she she got a degree in marketing <laughs> and hasn't really known what to do with it since graduating and isn't quite ready to go back for her master's. Um, but the clock is ticking. So... Uh, the thing about this that is so funny to me is uh, Yahtzee Croshaw did a Let's Play of Dark Souls 2. And when they started out, one of the conceits was every time you die, you have to fill in a little bit of the backstory of the guy they're playing. <laughs> it only lasted a little while, uh, but it was, it was pretty good for that little while. Like, you had to fill in the backstory of who this man was and what brought him to this sorry state. Well, her character arc, I mean, we know we know who she is. We know how she got here. She replaced my beautiful child. <laughs> and and we know what her arc is. And her arc is to become... Trying to earn the love of her creator? Trying to earn the... Well, I'm not her creator. Um, I, my, That's my the child lovely was, people at from my, my child was <laughs> stolen from me, and now my scorn has fallen upon this world. Um... <laughs> Her job is to have faith in herself, and then uh, uh, we'll see if she takes a path that wins my love, or um, if she's a heinous monster who deserves every death she uh, she encounters. Oh, you can you can goomba stomp people like you just did, and it does a very small amount of damage. Like I don't know if you noticed that you did three damage when you landed on that guy's head. Yeah, I saw that. I was trying to go for the. The plunging attack. Yeah. I really love those pants. I just can't. <laughs> I can't express that enough. Are we gonna have to power through this entire game in those pants? I mean, maybe. <laughs> if we can find better pants. I don't know what other options there are out there. We might be able to get some jean cutoffs with the little pockets hanging out the back. <laughs> okay, so let's go fight this guy. So that you hey, get cheeky, yeah. winky. God, <laughs> no. You've got three thousand souls. That's enough for another level. It is. Then I have to fight through the entire wave of guys again. Oh, I, was gonna, the... I was gonna say, that is the grind, isn't it? Yeah. And I will tell you the truth. The next bonfire ahead is a lot further than, like, the I one think the next there's not back. going to be any kind of story climax if we don't kill the son of a bitch. But at the same time, <laughs> I'm really bored of, of this area. So if you're gonna kill him, I suggest doing it now and doing it efficiently. <laughs> Yeah, there's a there's a long uh, long slog to the next bonfire. Is there? Yeah. Uh, well. I just assumed there'd be one after the big thing, but you would think that. But uh, Dark Souls doesn't care what you think. Clearly. <laughs> Are you All sure right. there's not a false wall or Marches something? Marches to walk <laughs> Marches to the beat of its own drum. I've heard they do that. <laughs> drum is made out of human skin. <laughs> <laughs> they do, but there there's not a there's not a special bonus. Um. Not to be grim, but I've heard that human skin is actually really bad for that purpose because it's so thin. For drums? Uh huh. Like you can probably tan it to a thickness that it'll work. Um, I think that has to do with like the like the thickness hey, of the actual skin and like the the 
Quick, kill it! That's the only way you can interact with anything in this world! What is it? What is it? I mean, when you kill it's it, you beautiful. find It's beautiful! Why are we that means it has it? to die. Why are we killing Why the one beautiful thing? Why are we hurting thing? the nice, pretty thing? That's that is remarkably robust. There Titanite. you go. Aww. Neat. Titanite is the thing that you use to upgrade weapons. We deserve this dark world. <laughs> we are the dark soul. <laughs> you know you're not wrong. Oh God, of course I'm not. <laughs> it makes you feel any better. On Twitter, I follow an account called at Hourly Cats. And they tweet a photo of cats every hour. Are you going to show me a photo of cats to, like, strengthen me through this trying time? I mean, if you want, I got it pulled up right now. Yes. Let me see this baby. Oh, my God, they're actual babies. Okay, <laughs> guys, I'm going to rate these buttons oh. for you. Oh, shit, that's right. Now, yeah, we, those guys. now we have two little, we have a picture of two little gray kittens on the left, and then, like, kind of a gradient of three light brown <coughs> kittens. It's really good. Um, it is a kitten bouquet. It's a kitten bouquet, and I would say that that's a uh, 10 out of 10. Good feline arrangement. Good feline arrangement, really good stem length. Um, <laughs> nice variety, kind of a traditional English garden bouquet of, of kittens. So I follow uh, hourly cats, and I also follow bodega cats, which is just pictures of cats from bodegas. Oh, mm -hmm. that's great. Yeah, it's a, it's a really good Twitter account. Are you sure you want to be using your fireballs here? I mean, for a first strike. Fair enough. I, I shouldn't, I shouldn't, This uh, hand glows with an awesome power. I shouldn't backseat Dark Souls. Despite the fact that the one literally doing that is Captain the What? You are literally backseat Dark Souls well, because of the way I our si be. seats oh, are set up. Yeah. Oh, boy. There it is. Now, I, too, follow cat Instagrams, um, specifically, uh, Dubu Cats. Oh, no. Uh, Dubu Cats and, uh, Nemamiya 12. Um, oh, highly recommended for your fat-faced Scottish folds. <laughs> um, Scottish folds are good cats. Very good cats. Very round faces, um, very fat cheeks, very tortilla chip ears. Now, how would you rate this cat that we are currently stabbing um, right in the dick? I would say, well, that's the thing. Or is it like dick space? Doesn't have dick space. Crotchal region. Might have like a cloaca situation, but I wouldn't, I wouldn't that. dare to assume. You don't want to presume. I don't want to presume anything about its business district. It's its own business. See, you're the only person I have ever heard refer to that as the business district. The, Almost everyone. Well, it's the district uh, that the business yeah. goes down on. Almost everybody else uh, will like refer to it as. Well, you should be able to collect those souls before triggering. A, as a guy pleasure guy. zone or a I'm, recreation area. No, no, area. it's about, it's about best, so. business. It has an <laughs> economy. It has a workforce. It has some, you know, like really complex. Metropolitan transportation solved. It's a business history. Fair enough. Where work gets done. So, Captain Emoji, how do you feel about your odds of getting those soul back, souls back and uh, fighting the tourist demon? I am hopeful about one of those things. <laughs> well, we got the homeward bones, so if you <coughs> don't want to uh, like risk it with that big bad guy with all those souls on the line. I think as long as I don't lose us those souls, I don't feel too bad about it. I will take my shot at the prize. At this point, we have but... a timeshare in this zone. <laughs> <laughs> well, we do. We bought that residence. Yeah. God damn it. I hate it when I'm extra right. <laughs> but it's my curse. Alright. I promise that uh, my next turn, I will mm -hmm. not try and kill the mm -hmm. big guy and mm -hmm. instead go kill the extra mm -hmm. big guy. Yeah, we'll see. Can we have, like, a smash cut, too? <laughs> <laughs> I was only waiting for permission. Just All go. I was waiting for was permission, by the way. <laughs> God damn it. Just go kill him. <laughs> hey! And you gave it. Mm -hmm. So. And nobody revoked their consent at any point. Mm -hmm. That is true. It was all consensual. A big unconsensual. Mm -hmm. These things still don't have a good name. They're just buds. They're just buds. 
just buds. They're just buds. Oh. No! <laughs> there's just oh. buds, and then there's flame buds. It's past your bedtime, and I think it might be past mine, because I'm yeah. definitely getting a bit punchy. <laughs> God, we're so old, guys. It's not even that late. It's 11.30. On a, it's on a weekend. 11.30 on a Saturday. We all need to go to bed. I, yep. need, I need to use my, my Clarisonic. <laughs> I need to put on some soft socks. Non-recreational oh, socks. Okay. Just the regular kind. Um, I don't remember where to go from here. Uh, back over the roof. Downstairs? Yeah. Under the ladder? Now make sure you take your bud with you. We have a, we have a strict buddy system. <laughs> I'm going to say, so Dark far Souls. we are kind whoa, of whoa, 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 whoa. Oh. You left your Is bud. Is he coming? No. Oh, too no, bad. come on. You know, that's the problem oh. with this bud. Is he oh. always is having like an asthma attack or something. Hey, <laughs> there we go. I, I uh, appreciate it. Okay, behind you. No, hold on. Which we're way? taking our buddy. But you have to go up that tower to kill that archer. Didn't you guys ever lose your buddy in like Which a museum way? or something? That way? No. I think I've been That's a lost buddy. Okay. I've so purposely yes. lost buddies and watched them to see what happens. <laughs> oh. That's one way to your left. There wasn't a lot Rather of other left. interesting things to do at Trinity Lutheran <laughs> Elementary School. I was going school. left. You told me my other left. More left. Be right. More left. There you go. Yes. Good job. Wow. Well, I don't know about good job, but <laughs> I got there. Eventually. You know what? At my ne own pace. Never challenge a compliment. Now you have to fight through those guys. I I'm going to disagree with that. Never challenge a compliment. As someone who has been on the receiving end of compliments from white supremacists. Like, that's ah, fair. yes. No, that's nebulous waters. <laughs> I don't know. I, I can't begin to give advice on that situation, but I mean, I'm not, so Gene, <laughs> take the goddamn compliment. <laughs> Speaking of compliments from white supremacists, uh -huh. uh, you all you all have met my wife. Okay, mm -hmm. who weird is, way to start that story. <laughs> who, is, who is very tall and very blonde and very Aryan. Uh-huh. And, uh... I died. I died. I'm oh. so sorry. A big deal. Well, we only lost you where did, you need where to did the other guy this, come from? You need to finish this story. It's in a you bad context right time. now. Oh, God. Oh. I, had, I had one of those samurai movie deaths where we cut each other down at the same moment. She... Uh-huh. Her, her father is uh -huh. uh, very... Not so much anymore. He's aged out a little bit. Well, uh-huh. Uh, used to do the gun show every year. Uh-huh. And... Every year... And you mean an actual gun show and not just like a biennial flexing event? Yes, correct. Okay. Whoop. <laughs> Thanks, auto-target. Really, uh, really tried to... Okay, so important that this story gets finished. <laughs> but she, she helps him out, would help him out at the gun show. Uh-huh. And every year would be very, uh, very politely treated by the white supremacy contingent. Uh-huh. Because just... She is basically the end result of Hitler's master race ideal. Ooh. Which is an unfortunate thing. Uh-huh. But she looks good, so there's that. Okay. Very tall, very blonde. Okay. That's, that's it. That's the whole story. That's the whole, okay, so the whole story is she helped her dad out of the gun show. And it's... And a bunch of racists think she's hot. Yes. Okay. Well. Compliments from. Strange, yeah, I think your wife is uh, lovely. District. But you're right. That's a difficult compliment to like. Difficult compliment to accept. Yeah, we don't. Yeah, we nobody wants learn. to hear from neo Nazis that yes, you are the ideal. Weirdly, Charm School didn't cover that. <laughs> I'd be worried if it did. Yeah. Like, oh, what Charm School did I get myself into? How is this a reoccurring problem? <laughs> Alright, let's go fight that Taurus demon. <laughs> in case you guys hear a haunted wailing in the background, that's actually my cat crying because it is bedtime. <laughs> he's he's definitely used to being, like, on a pillow. Well, I, I tuck him in burrito style by now. Yeah. <laughs> I was wondering how Garfield got like that, and you're telling me that that John... Who John Arbuckle hand-tucked <laughs> him in. 
Like, I feel like maybe... Well, he also knows how to make a very good lasagna, and those were always tucked in. That's true, you <laughs> gotta so get those... I always figured that he tucked in uh, Garfield like a oh, lasagna. Oh god, I could tear up a lasagna right now, though. Okay, Gus has started knocking things over to get our attention to make us go to bed. Did you guys ever notice that Garfield is lasagna colored? Yep. So do you think he's really just sentient lasagnes? It could be, like, he's consumed enough. He's actually the Lasagne singularity. <laughs> I mean, I can get behind that. I am sure that there is a fan-driven, expanded Garfield universe. Well there's, well, there's Garfield without Garfield. That is very good. Um, in small doses, if you read too much of it, it starts it's making depressing. things look dark. Yeah, it, get, yeah, yeah. it gets a little heavy. Uh, there is a rich, expanded Garfield universe licensed by Davis. Really? Yeah. Is there a Garfield tabletop RPG? There is not, but there is... <laughs> oh my god, a Garfield and Friends Let's RPG. Let's do it with GURPS. Let's do it with GURPS. <laughs> there is a, uh... We could probably release it as a Pathfinder module. That's true. You can release Christ. just about anything as a Pathfinder module. Christ. Uh, so, Jim Davis, if you're in the unlikely event that this somehow <laughs> makes it up on your digital beach, get in touch with us. Yeah, I'll Have write, we I'll got an fluff. opportunity for you? <laughs> I'll write the fluff. We'll get our friends to test the numbers. We'll get back to you um, with with this. We do have playtest experience, most of us. So when we do the Kickstarter, though, are we going to... Is, like, this special edition going to be a steelbook? Uh, but instead of that, it will just be sort of a pasta exterior? Uh, the, the special edition comes delivered to you in a lasagna tank. In a lasagna? But, like, what? what's the what's the lasagna situation? Is each page, in fact, lasagna a noodle noodles. with a, with a like, cheese-printed... Pond. You know, squid ink is food safe. I was about to suggest that, actually. <laughs> yeah, we could use... Should we, we break these barrels in <clears> case <throat> they have more jewel bugs in them? I think that that jewel bug is a one-time thing. Is it? Uh, we can find out if I beat this boss. If we go back through that door, I oh, will Dark Souls all of you. <laughs> You'll, like, get stabbed a bunch and then dodge roll off of a cliff face. Well, I took all three of them out before I fell, didn't I? That's a fair point. <laughs> You're not wrong. You're not wrong. Uh, when, uh, so when Captain Emoji... So can we sell Emoji... these extra weapons at any point? Eventually. I was gonna uh, say, like, we keep getting cracked shields, and I was like, these aren't useful. It anymore. is about halfway through the game that you can do that. Uh, yeah, yeah. Now let's meet the business cat. Oh my goodness, there he is. It's so there he angry. is. Are you just going to stand up there and shoot him with a crossbow? God, no. Uh, because he can jump up here. Uh, but that gives you more fighting space than the corridor that he wants to charge into. Actually, no. Oh, you just want to jump down to that. Okay. Because look how much damage I just did. That's fair. Now, do you oh, think... Oh, I missed my dodge. It did not think... even occur to me to climb up there and then jump down. Oh, uh, I missed my dodge again and I'm dead. Okay, it's... It is... It is... It is the sweet zone. So we are, we are done with this episode. I take it. Yeah, I, 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 yeah, I, I we think all had to go. God's trying to tell us something. Maybe and when we come back for the next episode, uh -huh. refreshed with a good meal in us, refreshed we'll beat and that, zesty. We'll beat that Doris team. We'll do it at not after bedtime. How about? Yeah, that's probably a good idea. But that does it for and we'll kill this the, episode. We'll, I guess we'll kill the tall thing. <laughs> for you guys, we'll kill the tall thing. You are so bitter about that guy. It's stupid. It's such a waste of time. And then we kept dying over and over. Oh, we didn't do it. No. Well, if we kill it's him, we get... It's too tall. I told you from the beginning. It's too tall. If we kill him, we get a really good sword. Aw. Uh, mm, mm. It did look like a nice sword. How come we don't get this cool shield, though? Uh, I think we get... Because it's as big as we are. We're not I, want, I want a tower shield. I'm cool with that. I think we can get that equipment a little bit later. I want actually. a. I want to use like four shields and create a kind of chrysalis. <laughs> um, oh, you know, it is really interesting that you say that because. Are you shitting me? Can you double equip shields? Uh, let's find out. I know that you can in future games, oh and it God. looks like you can in this one. And death <laughs> shall have no dominion. So, before we do anything else, uh, I'm going to check something out really quick. Oh. 
Nope. 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 <laughs> Oh it's not doing anything! Oh Hang on. Oh uh, oh, if you die, I swear. Oh, oh my god. <laughs> okay, there we go. Next time on Endless Mode, we're gonna fight the Taurus oh, demon and beat it. my god. We you, know what? you know what? You know what? You're a special guest forever, and you are pulled from the Toebanger marketing team. <laughs> like and subscribe. See you next time. Tell me how good my dual wield is yeah. in comments. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Bye, everybody. Bye. Bye. Uh. <laughs> Too tall.